Tobias, shut the fuck up! Ah! Uh What's up, YouTube? My name is Super Majin, and welcome back to Watch Dogs. Now, in the finale episode, the review, I said that we were not done with Watch Dogs just quite yet, and the reason for it is because of this right here. Watch Dogs Bad Blood. Um, I didn't read nothing up on the DLC. I don't know what it's about, so this will be fully blind. But we gotta play this before we move on to Watch Dogs 2. And depending how long this DLC is, I'm either gonna upload it, probably split it up, or I might upload it, um, in, in its entirety, so... We shall see! But let's go ahead and get this started. New game, let's see what this is about. I wish it gave us a description of what it was. stall next to her so man throws a cigarette into the toilet and <laughs> the whole thing catches on fire no fucking way what are you doing in here hey that's my fucking coffee <laughs> whoa 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 relax you guys first of all this is anything but coffee and secondly i'm here because head office hired me to run a pen test on your system and good job guys you passed Yeah. Hey, Ray. Hey, it's Tobias. Uh, yeah. Everything's solid here. Good. Okay, yeah, I'll tell him. Ray, she wants me to check Ray, your routers, too. Ray, listen to me. We need to talk. I think someone is watching me. Yeah. I was walking outside. Yeah, okay, will do. What? Thanks. Bye now. Ray, no, hey, look, Pencil Ray, pushers. Ray. What can you do, huh? Hey. Hey! <laughs> All right, we're playing as T-Bone. Bloom will know I'm here. I gotta move. I had high hopes for Bloom when I applied. I fell for the whole damn sales pitch. I knew we'd do something groundbreaking, but this thing was broken from the get-go. Now I'm too late, and the CTOS is too big. From the back, uh, T-Bone looks a little bit like Joel from Last of Us. The first one. Not the second one. We don't talk about the second one. Um. So, is this like a prequel or a sequel? Or not? That's not what I meant. Is it like before or after the events? I told you I didn't look up anything about this, so. If I say some stupid shit, just know. Just know because I don't fucking. I didn't read it up. Wait, I saw something. I saw a system key. Am I? All right, whatever. Let's just let's just get the fuck out of here. Actually, I have to go up here. Never mind. All right, cannot loot that toolbox. This is not the way to go. Ladder. Damn it! Locked in. I'm gonna have to find a vulnerable system pronto. You guys have any dialogue? No? Attract? Uh, not yet. Let's just unlock the thing first.
And then let's... Do I want to attract? Are you leaving? Oh! Help! That's weird. Holy shit! Five bucks for an autograph, asshole! God damn, dude! What am I using? Looks like a fucking hammer and a wrench at the same time. Shit must hurt. Pistol? Cool. Nothing else in here? I hope not. Can I go in here, though? Nope. Alright, buddy. I should probably use this camera first. Lock room? Is he in there? If I play it smart, I can trap some of these mouth breathers in their offices. He's actually fucking stuck. That's funny. Oh, there's two of them. Keep an eye in the hallway. I'll check the office. All right. Uh, let's see. Well, how do how do we want to do this? Camera. Oh, okay. They're moving. They're moving. Oh, there's a guy right there. Fuck it. Whoa. Something isn't right. I doubt this gun has a silencer. I fucking doubt it. It's going well so far. Lock room. Uh. Damn it. Is there anything in here? No. Do not turn around. <laughs> Ammo, nice. Let's just go with the pistol for now. Unless I... Oh, I do have a silenced pistol! Nice! Damn it, I should have been using that the whole time. It would have made things a lot easier. Oh well. I want to say this is after... Aiden? Like, the whole Watch Dogs 1 storyline? Because he does have, like, a beard going on. They just cut power to the elevators. I'm only hoping I get stuck in one. But then again, why would he be back at Bloom? I don't know. He ha he looks like he has some gray hairs going on. Somebody check the elevator. Hurry. Intrude. Stay awake. Damn, is there a security convention in town? I have never seen so many guards. What's going on? Raymond Kenny. No fucking way. Here? Well, that's what they're claiming. You know, my dad used to work with the guy. They said he was surly, but really just a big hippie once you got to know him. Yeah, well, your dad probably never saw any of the man's hobbies. I wouldn't relax just yet. Shit. Oh, 
That I'm surprised he didn't see me. Identify yourself. I still got focus. Suspicious object sighted. Going to investigate. Don't relax just yet. I can feel eyes on me. He's nearby. That's a The icons on the explode and lock room are confusing because they look they have the same logo as the system key. Uh with Aiden. Oh shit. I guess you're staying up there. Okay, good. I'm on my way, buddy. If I miss anything, fuck it. All right, I'm safe in here for now, but I'm gonna have to find a vulnerability pronto. I also don't know who Tobias is. He sounds familiar. But I don't remember. Uh, he was talking to him in the beginning of the cutscene. Ah, uh, here we go. My favorite part. It's actually not that bad. As long as it's not time. Huh. Okay. Crap. How do I want to do this? Uh Fuck. No, no, no. What why did you move that one? See, usually I don't think about these kind of things. That's why it's it's good that I do them. Or when I do them. Oh, I see. And then... There you go. Then you move that. Then you move that. And then... Oops. There you go. It took longer than usual, but... We got it. That's all she wrote. Time to bail. Well, shit. Zeroing the all that just for little old me. Can't get past the scope. That's a gun! Getting an angle. Ouch, man, who the hell shooting me? Fuck you. Can I even stay on here? I don't know if I can. Where'd he go? I'm on sight of him. Sonor Bloom. It's been real fun. 
2,000 meters? What type of shit are we talking about right now? Hold on. I don't know if I can fast travel. Can I fast travel? Hold on. I, I doubt it. Yup, unavailable. Cause we're on a mission. All right, I guess I'm gonna take this car. Oh shit! Do I even have the trip alarm? Uh, skill tree? It looks the same. Ah, oh, no, it doesn't. No, it does not. Well, fuck. Um. Oh, I already have it. Cool. Alright. Nice. Alright, I guess I'll meet you guys over there. Unless there's, like, dialogue that happens along the way. I'll leave that in, of course. t -Bone. What's up? Aiden. I just want to let you know I'm done. Well, it's about time. Do you have an escape plan? I just dumped a false trail into Bloom's system. Over the next two weeks, they're gonna see me pop up in Wichita, Amarillo, Tucson. I'll drop off their map somewhere in Mexico. I have to... I'm sorry, I have to... do that. Also, Aiden's voice sounds more raspy than before. This boy really became Batman. Are you heading the other direction? Hey, I've got a one-way cruise out of Miami. <sighs> If things ever calm down, I'll find a way to contact you. But... You take care of yourself, T-Bone. Stay out of trouble this time. Well, I intend to. Adios, amigo. Adios. Yeah, he had that whole Batman voice going on there. Jesus. He must have heard my review or something. Even though this game was made way before I did that, but... Whatever. Or the DLC I meant. All right, we're basically here. That's a truck. That uh, little phone call we had earlier with Aiden confirms that this is after the main storyline. Also, is T-Bone leaving? And why is he leaving? Maybe we'll find <sighs> out. Honey, I'm home. We will find out right now. Okay, not right now. That door is isn't uh, fake. First rule of survival, always use the back door. Or is it... Never make a copy of the key. I would say this DLC, the fucking ambient noise is quieter. So I'm gonna have to boost that up by a lot. It was already quiet before, now it's fucking silent. Activate the security system, alright. You ain't pretty, you ain't cozy. And you're sure as shit ain't home, but you were there for me when I needed you, baby. Where are we? No idea. Toggle moose? Yeah, sure, why not? I need to wake up my guard dogs. It's my base of operations, huh? You don't have any extra, like, system keys or something? I gotta burn these hard drives in the morning. Well, I never got to use these. I guess it's better to be an unfulfilled paranoid than a dead one. Go to sleep. Sure! Why not? Last night in the rabbit hole. I should get some shut eye. Let's go over here first. I don't know what's over here. It looks like a way out? Another elevator? Okay. I wish I can... Jog, maybe? Come on, T-Bone. We don't got time for this. 
If you want to hit the sack, you hit the sack. You don't fucking take your time. Usually when I'm tired, I just knock the fuck out. But you do you. Interesting sleeping position. No. No, I'm not answering you. Tobias is the hobo. Now I remember. No. Just fuck off. Go away. Now I remember. All right. All right. It's been ten years, Frewer. Hey. This had better be good. Ray, send the police. No, wait. Don't send the police. They may be in on it. Can you find me? Calm down. This is another one of your episodes. My episodes? Ray, they're gonna kill me. Do you understand? They who? I don't know. They, they hit me with something. I, I must have blacked out. I, I think maybe I'm in a trunk. I'm definitely in a trunk, Ray. Can you track me? Not very well. Your GPS signal's cutting in and out. Oh, of course. Oh, they're jamming it. Oh, this is bad. Like, fixer bad. Fuck. All right, I'm on my way. Sounds like Frewer is in real danger here. But if I'm gonna get out of Chicago, it needs to be now. Fuck. I can't just leave him. I know this is T-Bone's story, um, but it would be cool if, you know, Aiden helps a little bit. I, I actually like his character a lot, so he just comes in like a, you know, standard vigilante. He's like, I came to help for this one time and one time only, and then I'm gone. That type of thing. My phone battery is running low here. You gotta hurry. Calm the fuck down. Now, feel around the latch for a trunk release. If it's a newer car, it'll have one. Uh, no, nothing. All right, so we know we're in an old car. It's a start. Old car? No, that is not a start. Maybe they removed the trunk latch. You got any tools back there with you? Check for a compartment. There might be a jack in it. Yeah. Yeah, there's a jack. I I think I can pop the lid with one of these? That's the idea, but we don't want them to hear it pop. So I want you to bang around a lot when you do it. You shout, too. Hmm? Okay, here it goes. Hey! Hey, let me out of here! Help! Help! It's open. It worked. Just crack the lid. Tell me what you see. I see construction workers on the road. This is Chicago. That could be anywhere. Oh, road cones. I see a lot of road cones. Road cone? Road cone? Fucking road cones. Buildings for businesses. What do you see? Oh, that's... No, no, I don't know what that is. Come on, man. There's a half-demolished apartment building. Looks like housing projects. Sounds like you're in the wards. Good. Brewer. Anything else? Just a lot of buildings, Ray. Do they say anything? Well, I can't see. <gasps> Wait. More road cones. Hey, my phone is almost dead. Hurry. I'm coming, I'm coming. I see you. Okay, I need you to keep that trunk closed. Brace yourself. Hey, I don't want to die in here. Throw her. 
You okay in there? Let me out! Just hang on! Ah, shit! More fixers. Actually... Shit, these guys just don't know when to quit. Hang on! For a word! Where you at? There you go. Looks like we're clear. Get me out. I don't know what to expect when I open Get that truck. Out. Yo, calm the fuck down, Tobias. Jesus Christ. Fru was a mess when we parted ways. Aiden ran into it recently, said he was homeless. Doped up on something that barely yeah. coherent. Hell. Fru probably still blames me for all his problems. Somebody help me! This car is a This car is about to explode and I'm about to beat the shit out of Tobias. Don't hit anything. Oh my god. Can we just take him out of the trunk? No. No. Tobias, shut the fuck up. Oh! Don't hit anything. We're almost there! Calm the fuck down! I swear to god. Beat the fuck out of him. Use your wrench. Hammer thing. Yes, there you go! Beat his ass! Beat his ass! Jesus, Ray. You'd really zap me. Damn right I will. Just the lunatic with the tire iron. You annoying fuck. I'm not a lunatic. Doubt. So you gonna tell me what you did to piss off the fixers? Me? <laughs> this is on you. I'm still running from your mess. I have been ever since you and Rose decided to blow whistles at Bloom. I had a good life, Ray. You sure fooled me. We had to walk around on eggshells because you were such a head case. <laughs> well, Rose is dead now. And your little tantrum in 2003. How many people died? Yeah. <laughs> and I'm the head case. <laughs> You little shit. I'm sorry, I didn't... I, I... You know what? Thanks for the rescue. But I need to go. That's much more like it. The fuck out of here. Eleven. Eleven people died. Lindsay Garcia. Jeremy Connors. You want more? Because I can list them all for you. If you run, Bloom will find you. I know, because I'm the one who wrote the goddamn code that'll help him to do it. Now, I can get you out. But I need to hit Bloom again. Find out what the hell they know. You can stay in my place. Just don't touch my stuff, don't monkey with my system, and don't make any noise. Yeah. I'll try to control myself. Try? Most importantly, do not touch any of my beer. I don't drink. Of course you don't. Wasn't planning on sticking around. 
I need to make a call. Aiden? That's not Aiden. Detective Billing speaking. Sheila. Mystery man, is that you? I assumed you were dead. Did you miss me? Nope. I love the growing tower of crime reports on my desk. Please tell me that's why you called. Mm-hmm. Well, I'm running low on cash. And supplies. Well, there's plenty to do. Every gangbanger, goon, and gorilla's out there fighting for a piece of the cake now that Lucky Quinn and Iraq are dead. And I'm running out of people to trust within the department. Just pull me in the right direction and I'll do the dirty work. For a fee. Taxpayer money, keeping the thugs off the streets. Ain't it beautiful when the system works, sweetheart? <laughs> you are bad. Hold on. I'll send you what I've got. Let me check my map. I've marked one of the groups for you. The Chicago South Club. Now spearheaded by Quinn's baby boy. Baby boy? All right. Some of these will be one-time targets of opportunity, and some of them will be done to send a message. Hit those once a day, so they know we're watching. Just remember, if you get caught... Never heard of you. Good. Give me a call before you go in. Also, disclaimer, um, I have my fan almost cranked up, because it's... Google says it's 71 degrees, but it feels like 90. And we're talking Fahrenheit. If it was Celsius, I would be fucking dead. Alright, is he in one spot? Okay, I thought it was a moving target. You help Sheila in her gang investigations. Knock out the two tar- Oh my god, no! Ah, uh, why? Why do I have to knock out? Just let me kill all of them. God damn it. This is like a gang hideout on crack. I, I did not like the gang hideouts in the main game. Well, this is gonna suck. Place your bets how many times I'm gonna fail this one. That's a cop. That's a cop. Oh! No, 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 no. You sack of shit! I don't want it! I better not see that bitch again. You better despawn. I don't need no cops right now. So much for shortcuts. Knock out the two targets. Right, but I can't just. But I. Sheila, I'm out to spawn. I'm about to head in. All right, watch yourself in there. These guys are connected. If they weren't, you know I'd have them behind bars already. Somebody's keeping my hands tied, which means they've got friends in high places. Which means they got the best gear money can buy. I'm counting on that. Don't get too cocky. I'm sending you all the information I've collected on them so you know just what you're getting into. Thank you, detective. All right, here we go. Oh, I remember this spot. This is where I got my first copyright claim because Wu-Tang was playing.
Is that it? Only... Is that it? I have to knock those two down? Why are they fucking next to each other? Oh my god. Damn it. Why is one of them a sniper? This is straight garbage. Uh, what do I want to do? Do I have any attractables? Blur? Get in there and find him. Find him. Let's go here. Nothing here. Moving on. Come down I here. See shit. Over there. I'll look over there. Don't see anything. Gonna move on. I got nothing here. Whoa! Uh, you. Oh, that's it. All right, listen. I got we can't get all of them, so just wear them down. Grab some men. We can't let this guy get away. Oh. Oh. Fuck, we got a man down. Shit. I can explode that. You fucked with the wrong guy. What are you waiting for? Today. Use the grenade. Oh, shit. Reinforcements! I need some help here! Fuck you. No reinforcements. Uh, I'm out of ammo, aren't I? Uh, shotgun. Nah. Alright, come here. Pick it right out. Pick. Yo, if I died right there, I would have been really upset. How do I want to do this? How do I want to lure him out? Uh, craft one. Put it there. Tracked. No, you're not falling for it, huh? If I leave the area, will I fail? <gasps> Search around. Don't be sloppy. Here! Fuck you! That wasn't too bad. Sheila, I got her done. Haven't lost your touch, mystery man. I've sent your payment, and like I've said, there's still plenty to do with your game. I'll let you know. Actually, they must have had ammo, right? I'm struggling out here. All right, all right. Uh, how about you? Ammo, ammo, shotgun. I don't really fuck with shotgun in this game. Got a sniper though. Thanks, buddy. There's probably some more stuff, but I'm gonna go ahead and leave. Uh, where do we need to go? We have a lot of fast travel options. Okay. Driving contract. Oh no. These are like new activities. Why do you do this to me, man? Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. Online street sweep? No, thank you. Driving contract. Ah, oh, for fuck's sakes. Compete with other players for the best score. No. Alright, look. I'm gonna go ahead and pass. Because it says compete with other players. The one I'm probably only going to be doing is um, probably this one, if I get the chance. But let's just focus on this right now. 
Needs of the few. Can I fast travel, please? No. Fa God damn it. Come on, game. There you go. We will do it by the end. But we're not gonna. We're gonna focus on the main mission right now. Do I have to go in the front? Also, new outfit. I don't know if I can equip that right now. I think I have to be in the actual hideout. Can I start it? God damn it. <sighs> Tobias always did know how to get my goat, but he's stuck with me, so he's gonna have to deal. If there's a chance I can get him out of this, <sighs> I owe it to him to try. I'm giving up a hell of a lot to do it, too. Like, for all I know, he's probably already split on me. Shit. Did that say Act 1? Ah, oh, fuck. Well, there goes me uploading this whole thing in its entirety. I doubt we can get this done under two hours. At least it's worth your money, I guess. If you buy the DLC. I would change my clothes, but I like this outfit. Also, it's the first session, so why not leave it default? Ray, this place is amazing. I, I can't believe you live here. Lived. I'm past my checkout time. So we need to figure out what Bloom offered for your contract and who they paid. I need a way back into Bloom's system, but our date last night ended messy. So I'm hoping to find a CTOS access point that's a little less armed. Your old think tank. Is it still there? Bloom Forge? Yep, still there. Sometimes I raid their garbage for spare parts. Don't underestimate that place. It may have started as a hacker space, but Bloom poured in money. Do not underestimate these guys. Expect engineering gone wild. Mad science on a corporate budget. Yeah, I think I can handle a few nerds with expensive toys. I'm bringing Eugene. Eugene? Who the hell is Eugene? Also, the main game had five acts, so I'm assuming this will have three acts. Assuming. I don't think Eugene's a person. Eugene? Here, boy! You have a dog? I'm allergic to dogs. He's not a dog. Well, I'm allergic to cats, too. Should I look around? There might be some parts and stuff. Uh, let's just... Actually, where do I need to go? Oh. I don't see anything... related to loot around here. It's a car! Toy car! Probably with C4 on it. Or something. Alright, nothing over here? Okay. I can't move the camera while I'm in here. Or while this thing is moving. Now I'm all set for Bloom Forge. If the doorbell rings, don't answer it. I don't think these guys use doorbells anyway. Why do you sound louder as I go farther away from you? That doesn't make any sense. I won't lie, this whole, um... Elevator thing can be a little bit tedious. Just waiting for it to go up and whatever.
Did that say 3,000? Oh my fuck. Can I? Can I? You really want me to drive, don't you? Alright. I'll meet you guys over there. Unless there's dialogue. You know me. Electronic musician Default is trending in social media after footage of last month's bizarre show appeared online. The rat faced DJ abandoned his set midway through the performance after a run in with alleged vigilante Aiden Pierce. Fans are left wondering was the whole encounter staged or was Default simply in the wrong place at the wrong time? Whichever the case, sales for Default's newest album have gone up. Good for Dead Mouse. Good for him. Only in America could somebody be completely anonymous and a public figure. I wonder what he's hiding under that mask. I thought we saw him already. Did we not? I guess I don't I don't remember if his mask uh fell off. The Chicago South Club only recently buried their criminal patriarch, Dermot Quinn. But his son. Neil Quinn was questioned by the CPD this week for his suspected involvement in a series of fire bombings throughout Mad Mile. We're told that although no charges have been made, police will continue to put pressure on the club to prevent another lucky. The way Aiden described him, I don't think there will ever be another lucky. Still, there's an infinite supply of assholes ready to step into his old penny loafers. Honestly, there should have been DLC um, where we play as Aiden again, but we fight his son. A Lucky Quinn's son, not his son. Um, that would have been nice, because I'm pretty sure Watch Dogs 2 is nowhere close to Aiden's storyline. It's like GTA, you know? It's like another... A whole new branch. But who knows? Maybe they are connected somehow. Maybe through CTOS or some shit. There's not a lot of cars on the street. Surprisingly. I need to get in and out before they realize I've changed my MO. Do I have a uh... unlock skill to craft? Uh... Do I even have any six? Okay. I don't have a system key though, so that's not really gonna do anything for me. I do want this though. Steam pipes can suck a fucking dick. Blockers, I don't care. Black market? As a result of your militia investigation, you can now name drop in pawn shops. Oh. Guns for cheap? Interesting. Okay. Damn it, we might have to do those then. That's. Ugh, that sucks. I want the CTOS scan, even though I don't have a system key. It's better to have it than not have it. And that's all we can fucking do. Shit. This is gonna suck. I don't know where anybody's at. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. I wanted to zoom in on him, but I don't know why I thought I could zoom on on him. Ah, oh, shit. There's a guy over there. You're not gonna mark him? There you go. Damn. They ain't slacking on security here. Nice. Whoa! 
I missed all those fucking shots, man. Fuck. That was a headshot? I'll take it. I'll take it. Goodbye. I gotta walk around these guys for ammo. I'm actually scavenging. There's a guy upstairs. Sure. Is there another staircase? No. God damn, it's a fucking long way up. You're not gonna mark him? Fine. How about now? Mark him! Come on, game! do you even see me? Huh? Is that? Is that death? Yes, it is. Not gonna lie, I thought there was more guys here. This is not even that much. Well, as much as I thought. Let's try to conserve ammo. If I don't get stuck on a chair, goddamn. Sup, buddy? Yo, I literally kicked his fucking ass there. Wait a second. I think I see something. Do you? And that's everyone. Wait. They've got something set up here. Let's see if I can spoil the surprise. What the hell? What kind of laser system is that? Is it just one straight line? Going left and right? Where's the starting point? This side? Okay. Uh. Oh, what the fuck? Okay. Uh, then this, then that, then that, then something like that. And then boom. Uh, uh, uh. Sneaky. It was one laser. We did not need to hack that. We did not need to do that. Like, come Ooh. on. I'm looking at lasers here. Uh, what kind? Lasers. How many kinds are there? Uh, well, in the gas laser family alone, you've got eight types. Uh, nitrogen, carbon dioxide, argon. Damn it. Security lasers. Oh. Oh. Those are mine. What? Well... Can you bypass it? Well, no. I mean, I ordered them before I got promoted out of Bloom Forge. I can't believe they kept them. The guys always did love retro tech, but you trip one of those and Bloom Forge goes offline to prevent a breach. Shit. But did we need to hack that though? Like, it's fucking obvious that you have to avoid the. Come on, man. That was unnecessary. Like, how dumb can you be to not- what the hell? Like, how dumb can you be to not know how to avoid that? It's literally one laser pointing- you know what, I'm over it. I'm over it! I'm over it. That was a little bit just 
I, I don't understand the stupidity in that. Also, I'm pretty sure there would be elevator music right now if I did not turn it off. It's a long way down. How you guys doing? Doing good? Doing alright. Burning my ass off. Sweaty. Are we here yet? No? Oh, we're here finally. Oh, cool. Look how easy it is. Oh my god. That was so hard, dude. There was no way I could have bypassed that. Fucking stupid. Uh, no way through for me. Eugene? You're up. See, that's more like it. That's more complex. The fuck is that? Old weapon wheel. RC car. Wait. Oh, I can craft them. But I have one available, so I'm just gonna do that. Stun. Activate special ability. Eugene's wired up to my phone, so anything I can do from here, I should be able to do the same through his camera. It's my special ability, though. Bet these eggheads never saw this coming. Well, I guess we're gonna find out. It just has the audio law. Oh, there's two of them. So Bloom's been looking at investing into our hacker space, and that's got everybody at each other's throats. Some of us want to avoid the corporate control. Kind of goes against the spirit of what we do here, right? But on the other hand, we're talking about big money, and that means the projects get bigger. We could do something real here instead of just playing around. Bloom's promising we won't take away any of our creative control. They say they want to invest, not dictate. Do I trust them? Not entirely. Is the risk worth the reward? Yes. But I'm in the minority here. These guys would rather discuss Starship engineering than our future here. I'm gonna have to convince them. Also, why do people fixate on the aesthetics of a Starship? There's no need to be sleek in space. Functionality is key, not... not form. They moved Rose and I into a proper Bloom Lab this week, and... We were introduced to our new project. They're calling it the Central Operating System, CTOS for short. Software to run an entire city. I knew we were going big, but this is big. We'll be working on a test site. We're calling it the Bunker. I met one of my new partners today. Everybody went quiet when he walked in. He's a hacking legend. Best of the best, they say. Looked like a knuckle dragger to me. Right away he started picking on me. Said my parents were, and I quote, a pair of dirty douchebags for naming me Tobias, and he's gonna call me Fruer from now on. Nobody's called me Fruer since gym class back in high school. I'm not gonna let this hooligan ruin a good thing for me. Well, you get what you deserve, Tobias, you fucking bunch of dirty douchebags. Alright. Um, forgot to mention in the review, I did not do any of the collectibles, or I should have done more, but, uh, I did my best. Not really interested in collecting all the collectibles, 100%ing, or whatever. Women's bathroom, we can be a perv if we wanted to. This is super slow. Nice work, Eugene. Time to come on home. I want to know what the stun and the special ability... Ah, oh, come on. Looks like I'm gonna have to do some rerouting to shut these down. What the fuck? Oh, that's kind of cool. What? That's actually that's nice. 
That's that's cool. I wonder if we're gonna see more of that in the second game. Alright. Oh nice. This place feels very you, Frewer. Thanks. I I think. What were you working on? Before Blue. M modular valve control system is built to expand or retract based on internal pressure changes. Oh, and the lasers. Yeah. Definitely you. See, this is a little bit more complicated. So I want to do this. Not bad. Oh. Oh, unstable. Okay. Uh, hack. System key. Nice. Now how do I go about doing this? Yeah. And then left to right. Yeah. Uh. Then maybe something like this. Let's wait. Patience is key. And we're out. Mm. Looks like I'll have to hack my way through here. Open that for the car. Electronic parts. Alright. Let's do this. You know, I was gonna say this drives super slow, but I'm kind of glad I drive super slow. Oh, do I get to use my special ability? The fuck? No? What was the point? You told me I can do it in the tutorial. Ah, uh, fine. Fine. Just wanna stun some bitches, you know? That's not the right button. Fine, we'll just bypass them. I didn't wanna fucking be boring, but... Whatever. What the hell's going on? What the fuck? Ah, looks all right. Oh. Fuck. Uh, sure. I think I'm safe. I should have probably went that way. Oh! Wait, 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 wait. I probably don't want to do the forklift method. This looks like it could have been another way. Alright, never mind. It could have been an alternate route. I guess the forklift only, huh?